Can I get just a single big crunch and a coffee? Uh, we actually don't do coffee. Okay, I'll just get a big crunch then, please. Just a sandwich? Yeah. Okay. Thanks. That's good. Uh, can I get a large double-double, please? Actually, two milks and two sugars. Two milk, two sugar, for sure. Yeah. Would you add a muffin to that today? No, no thanks. Okay. That's going to be 210 at your first drive-thru window. Perfect, thank you. Hey guys, so for most of you that don't know, I'm on Vancouver Island, British Columbia, Canada, okay? It's a big rock. I'm going to Lake Cowichan. Yeah, I gotta clean my windows. But um, this whole rock is basically a forest. You know, I'm just uh, going down the highway, but you can see the mountains in the background. So that's why I love it over here. Like the, the amount of wood on this island is pretty well endless until they clear cut it all. So I gotta go get ready to, to um, go head to my buddy Tim's and uh, he's having a bunch of buddies over and we're gonna have a Yahtzee night, the Yahtzee gamble night. Three bucks a game. So yeah, I just I better start driving, stop talking. Okay guys, so here I am on uh, Vancouver Island. I just had to come for a break, but really, is any of this a break? Look, look at all this wood. Cedar guys, like crazy. So this is my buddy's Mitch place and I've been getting wood from him for a few years when I really first started carving. So we we're pretty good friends and I haven't seen him in a year so I thought I'd stop by. So once again, when I'm here, like look, what's this? More cedar, guys, look at this stuff. This is like paradise here. He's got a mill here. He builds things, I'll, I'll go up to him and ask him. But like look at all these logs here let me turn the camera around so yeah you can see all the wood he's got here like tons of it this is nothing guys wait till i take you to the heart of his operation so but yeah i used to fill up my come over here get wood from him fill it up and take it back to the mainline main line it's a two-hour ferry trip over here i want to show you guys something here this is really for my uh, wood turning buddies. This is for Pete. Pete, look at that. Look at the size of this burl. Hey? This is a big maple burl, man. Look at those burls. Look at all these cedar logs. Look at all these logs here, guys. Look at all the burls on that tree. But look at this stuff. This is maple. The size of that. Like here, look at my hand, just to give you a... This thing's massive. Massive tree, so look at the size of the cedar tree. This guy's just been loading up since I've been here last time. Old growth. Look at this twisty thing. I think this is part of that uh, maple burl. Here's their uh, wood shop there. We'll go over there in a minute. No one copyright strikes. So here they are working here. His uh, outdoor mill. He's a wicked builder, man. He's gonna be starting his uh, a YouTube channel. Look at the size of this cedar. Look at that. Massive. Cedar, guys. Look at all this cedar. Okay, so this is kind of his just pile of wood. This twisty thing. Here's a big burl. I bought one a year, ago, uh, a couple years ago off them, and I made my first eagle out of one of these burls. It's at uh, the place where I carve. So I'm gonna be picking up some of these uh, slabs here. I'm gonna be picking up these actually thing. We've already talked about it. This is old growth cedar. And uh, yeah, these boards here, I'm gonna be getting those off them to cutting them up to make uh, Christmas trees. So yeah, 
He's going to be sooner or later starting his own YouTube channel, but he just wants to clean it up around here. He's just so, the guy's so busy, so hectic. He doesn't really have much time to organize things, but sooner or later he will. These boards just everywhere. I'm in heaven when I come over here, guys. Total heaven. This is where I need to live. This is what I need to do. Well, not build things, but just have uh, a cedar here. This has got a little back hole. Hey Mitch, is it okay if I come over there for a sec? Yeah, you like Look at this piece of old piece of wood. He, what kind of wood is this with these burls on it? Maple. Maple burls, Pete. Look at those. So this is Mitch's workshop, guys. This is Mitch. Hey, how's it going, man? Yeah. Sorry, what's your name again, man? Brad. 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 What are you guys building here? Oh, uh, we're building uh, a pavilion. A pavilion. Yeah, looks like that right there. Oh, okay. So no roof or That's just... the basement. A lot of roofs over there. It's already made in three pieces. It's already assembled. Gets taken out of here, loaded on the truck, and then goes up on the crane and uh, goes together in three pieces. You put it this whole thing together, three yeah. pieces. Yeah. See, so guys, look, look at all this kind of what's this carpentry work you could call, or what would you call this stuff? Well, like this is woodworking, timber framing. Timber framing. And this is Douglas fir, obviously. Yeah, that's fir. What kind of wood do you think um, weathers the best? What's your opinion? Cedar. Cedar, obviously. Yeah. That's why the Indians made. Yeah. Cedar? Uh, what about um, hemlock? I uh, no. Because I did, actually I didn't tell you this, but I did a uh, board on the White Rock Pier. Yeah? You know the White Rock Pier, the longest pier in Canada? I, yeah. I carved one of the boards on that actually. Is it? One of the first boards and I thought it was going to be cedar, yeah. but they use hemlock for that. Well, I mean, hemlock's mostly used just for interior, doing uh, door trams and door jams, and yeah, I think it just doesn't. It just doesn't. It doesn't. Uh, boom! Fucking have the outside fucking just, hang in there, kind of shit, right? Yeah, yeah. It okay. holds its moisture for a long time yeah. too, doesn't it? Hemlock it's wet, does. It's a wet log. It's a wet log. Yeah. <clears throat> it's just uh, yeah. It's not rot resistant. Yeah, I was surprised. Like when they they use those boards for hemlock and. Uh, I thought it would be cedar or Douglas fir or something like that. You know what I mean? You just keep, keep slamming on that Thompson's water seal. Which yeah, the Thompson's water seal. Okay, guys. Well, let's get back to work. Thanks okay. for uh, let me stop in here get and let's adventure, go. Man. Let's go and we'll look at. You got to start your YouTube channel, bud. Yeah, well, uh, we're getting on it. We're getting on it. We're yeah, we'll be we'll, doing some. Uh, we've been doing some time lapses and uh, got the GoPro thing happening. Yeah, we'll that. we'll get over here do some carvings and just fucking it's, get her done. It's coming down the line, man. Down. <laughs> we're getting, down. Thanks, guys. Okay, man. We'll see you later, man. Okay. Come by and pick up that cedar tomorrow. Yeah, I'm just going to look around here a little bit more. So, yeah, they're, those guys do pretty wicked work. And uh, look at this. I think this is Douglas fir here. Okay, anyways, guys, i got to get going. It's getting dark here. and um, But would you look at the size of that burl, Pete? Maybe next time I'll cut out some blocks for you. I'll talk to Mitch about it and see how much I can get some blocks for. Burrow wood everywhere. Hey guys, this is just when I started doing chainsaw curving. Look at this old wood spinner I got here. Mitch was supposed to put it up, but he never did yet. But look at that piece of wood, how it, poor old guy, just lying here. His son even named him. But yeah, look at this branch kind of goes up here. He had a shop, he was going to hang a sign off there. Mitch, get this spirit up, your son named him. <laughs> 